What's the worst thing you've ever seen? Something that you just can't get out of your mind. Something that will stay in the back of your eyelids forever. Do you have it? Now on three, I want you to say it with me. One, two, three. You're not going to CrankGameplace.com and getting the new Soft Boy merch. Wow, it's all blacked out and there's the normal stuff is restocked too. Go to CrankGameplace.com for the big Black Friday sale. I'm just kidding. That's not the worst thing I've ever seen. We're about to find out what the worst thing I've ever seen is. Today, we are not our slash cursed images. We're gonna see the worst things in life. So, our slash cursed images all images posted on here must be cursed. Uh, is this video gonna get demonetized? I feel like it. I feel like I'm not gonna be able to look at a lot of stuff. Don't put that in the video. Fuck. Jesus Christ. Like this image to die immediately. This is really fucked to look at. It's really hard to look at. Jeepers. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Damn. Those gorillas know what's up. Oh, damn. And those kids are learning. It's all the circle of life, guys. It's the circle of life. We all know it. Oh, oh, that's so gross. Oh my God, that's disgusting. This is all mold, but what is the mold from? What substance was on the keyboard? Oh no. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. What the fuck? This is horrible. Joe, the people follower, tired of feeling alone? Oh, no one watching or caring? I'll follow you, 10 foot guarantee. I will not near fear in your life. You will barely notice me but you will feel me. JoeThePeopleFollower.com won't leave you alone. That's creepy as hell, dude. This is the worst thing I've ever seen. This is the worst thing I've ever seen. Cursed MRI. Yeah, this is what your face looks like in an MRI. This is so horrifying. This one's kind of funny. This is all so bad. This one I think is the worst. Yucky. All right, that's so weird. Oh, weird, 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 weird. That would be so stressful to be around. It's just so... Like, er everything about the proportions is, like, really unnatural. Ugh. That can't be real. That's photoshopped, right? That can't be real. First of all, to fit your fist in your mouth is so hard. But then to swallow someone, like, up to their elbow, that's this long. There's no way. That's gotta be fake. Um, I'm... There's layers to this one. I'm just gonna leave this one here. I'm just gonna leave it here. God, using a vibrator for an- I mean, it would probably work. Why am I the one going, oh my god, using a vibrator? I just did this the other day. I cooked with a vibrator for a video. Oh my god. Master of hide and seek right here. Master of hide and seek. This is terrifying though. I went in a room like this around Halloween. There was like, uh, there was an it too, like, um, little like carnival thing. And it was like a fun house. And one of the rooms was like this patterned wall. And then these people, uh, had like full body suits on that was all the same pattern as the wall and you just don't notice them especially because it's darker like it's not completely dark but it's dim it was oh god and then they like will randomly move they don't jump out at you at all which is the scariest part because you have to look you have to like when you realize that they're there is the scariest thing about it it's terrible oh my god that's such a good halloween mask honestly though that's awful that's super fucked but that's a really good Halloween mask. Did his face react before it even happened? His face can tell the future. Got his neck just a defense mechanism. It's like Spidey senses. It sense it and then just <laughs> just sensed it. Wow. What made you do this? What made you do this? Get out of there. You're not a fish. I don't want you to be a fish. I would never. I would never. I would never have you as a fish. Oh, this makes me sad because this is either photoshopped, which I don't think it is, or they're spray painted. That's so sad. <sighs> the most dangerous game, dude. You guys are fucking idiots. Oh my god, I hope that's not real. You guys are literally toast if that falls in the water. God, the seconds right before a tragedy. This is the, like the screen that they cut to with the to be continued meme. This is the frame where the meme pops up right here. This looks like the pie that I made on the Marco Pie makes. Oh God, it's the same, I made that pie. Oh my God, that is terrible. Ain't nothing curse about this, dude. It's a long, lanky skeleton dude just chilling out in the night, probably just like, you know, smoking a cigarette or whatever. He's just chilling. He's just vibing out there, honestly, just in the open air, listening to the crickets and the frogs. He's just chilling. Don't disturb him like that. Just let him, just let him sit. Gumballs and bouncing balls mixed together. Why would you do that? Why? That's so stupid. Why would you do that? Will you be the chicken to my nugget at prom. A lot of effort there, and you get a bunch of free nuggets if you want to eat them off of his body, I suppose. Nothing cursed about that. It's it's innovative. No one's ever done that. No one will ever do it again. Uh, 
That is the worst. Oh my God, why? Why is this a thing? It looks so real too. I hate that. I hate that the most. That is terrible. Is this a real thing? How, okay. With shit like this, where, you know, it's probably at like some, you know, kid place or whatever. So they're not trying to make a joke about it. How does this happen? How does no one notice? It also, the thing over here, it looks like his fly's undone. How does no one notice this? And say, hey guys, maybe we should redo the model because it looks like SpongeBob's dick is out. How do people, and again, I don't know if this is photoshopped or not, or if this is fake or real or whatever, but if this is real, how does this happen? Because shit like this does happen. Like the inflatable things where you crawl inside of Spider-Man's ass or whatever. Oh my God, he's eating the child. Oh my God. Oh my God, Mickey has a vor fetish. Oh my God, it's confirmed. That's why, oh my God. The Disneyland rides. It's like a fantasy for Mickey because everyone is inside of the park. Everyone is inside the rides. Everyone's, you know, going in and out of tunnels. It's a vor thing, dude. He just wants everybody inside of him. Figure it out. This is me. Me and all my friends when we figured it out. I hope this is like a church play or something like that. And they just had all these little kids dressed up like cockroaches. Or it's just a random day that people decided to, to do. Guys, ain't nothing greater than a harmless prank. Honestly, if you're in school, just round up like 30 or 40 kids to just put on like a weird costume or something during the day. Nothing that will disrupt disrupt the day or disrupt others or anything like that. Just something weird, just something real weird. Like dressing up like a cockroach for the entire, just like get a bunch of people to do shit like that. God, it's so funny. Now here's a question, this is a real question. Is this real? Because I feel like, uh, this is a genuine question. I feel like they wouldn't be allowed to let people in fursuits on a ride because it is potentially hazardous. Uh, because like, what if the the head flies off and shit like that? Like sometimes they even make you take your hat off and stuff like that. I don't think they would let anybody on with a full fursuit. Granted, no idea when this was happening. Those are my final thoughts on that. Okay. What a supportive friend though. He's just throwing up after a long night of drinking, you know, his little monkey friend, after a long night of drinking, he's just like, there, there, pal. He's rubbing his back. He's, shh, 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 it's gonna be all right. I'll get you some, I'll get you some water, you know, I'll get you some Tums, whatever you need. You can crash on the couch. I'll get a pillow for you. What a good friend. He is a good friend. His ass is hanging out a little bit, but he's a good, good friend. This is one of the grossest things I've ever seen. One of the grossest things I've ever seen in my whole life. God, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it so much. I love it so much. This little Kirby standing out on the street corner. This is this is so zoomed in too. So you know that there's a wide photo of this somewhere where you just can barely spot it. Picture yourself at, at 2 a.m. You're walking to go and get a glass of water and out of the corner of your eye, you see something on the corner and you're just like, huh, that, that is weird. And then, and then you look, you, you decide to investigate. And there he is, the great ball of anger himself, Kirby standing there, staring directly at you. At first you think maybe he's just facing the direction of me, but no, his eyes are locked on you. His knife firmly grasped in his hand. This is no mistake. This is intentional. Anyway, I'm gonna end the video there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so proud of myself, guys. Honestly, I know that there's gonna be a lot of Reddit videos and a lot of Pokemon videos that are coming out, but but, 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 I'm going on vacation for almost two weeks and I prep videos for every single day and I wouldn't be able to do it without my boy, Justin. Justin, give yourself a round of applause. I'm just making you do more work for yourself. If you don't know Justin, Buff Daddy HD over on the Twitter. He also streams too. Uh, just started editing for the channel. So he's, he's editing all the videos. Um, so Justin, <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you so much, everybody. Give a big old clap, clap, clap to Justin in the comments. Uh, he will be in the link in the description. So go and check out Justin as well. Great guy. And I wouldn't be able to do this without him. I barely got all my recordings done, uh, but I wouldn't have been able to do it without him. But proud of myself because I got two weeks of content all prepped and ready for you guys. So yes. Anyway, that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a good day. <laughs> Stay lit. You know, vibes always good. All right. Bye. Vlogger outro. What is that my crazy proof?